Hey YouTubers, welcome to another episode of Tone Blast Tuesdays. My name is Tanitha and today is an ab workout, specifically focusing on the lower gut pooch area by doing balancing exercises. We'll be using a bouncy ball and a weight plate. If you don't have a weight plate, you can, I think you can use a dumbbell. I've never tried it with a dumbbell. We'll be placing it on our actual stomach. So maybe a book. I'm using a five pound weight plate, so something that's five pounds and that's comfortable when you place it on your stomach. And before we get started, today is August 25th, and I'm not sure if any of you are Aliyah fans, but I've always been a huge Aliyah fan and will continue to be one forever. And today marks the eight year anniversary of her death. She died in a plane crash coming from the Bahamas back to the States after shoot, shooting her last video, Rock the Boat. So just wanted to pay tribute to her. May she rest in peace. And with that said, I'm going to go ahead, do some cardio, which you should be too. And I'll see you guys in a little bit. Get excited. Hey, YouTubers. Hey, YouTubers. Hey, YouTubers. exercise is a balancing exercise. Go ahead and raise your right foot. Raise the opposite arm. And then raise both arms to an L position. And then raise both arms to the top and hold. Lower back down to an L position. down to the first position and all the way down. We're going to do this on the left with the left foot raise and then we're going to repeat the whole thing. And this exercise, like any balancing exercise that you do, helps to train your lower abs in. So pulling your belly button into the spine. Once you've gotten really good at doing this exercise, the ball should feel like a chair. It should not move around. It should be completely stable underneath you. So in order to do that, you need to concentrate on pulling your abs in, specifically the belly button to the spine. We go, go ahead and repeat the same exercise. And the next exercise that we do, I apologize, the video got cut. So we're going to do 10 reps on the right hand side. You will see me doing that. But the left hand side, you'll only see me do three reps. But make sure you do 10 and it will be on the bouncy ball. Go ahead and do the left hand side. And you'll notice that I don't do my opposite arm. It's easier if you raise your opposite arm to the leg so that you balance your body. If you do same arm, same leg, your body will naturally move to that side. So if you can do same arm, same leg, go for it. However, I would start off doing opposite arm, opposite leg. So we're back down in the L position. Okay, go ahead and lie on the ball. This is another balancing exercise. You're doing a crunch, but lifting the leg. This time it's my right leg and pulling it in. You want your shoulders to be on the ball as I fall off. <laughs> and that was 10. We're going to go ahead into the left-hand side. And remember to do 10. I only get to 
three or four in this video. All right, sorry about that, but go ahead and grab your plate. That's what a plate looks like. And you're gonna crunch, so bring your knees in and your hands to your knees. And if you can, bring your feet down to the ground. We're gonna do 10 of these. Your lower, your entire lower back should be touching the ground. So if you feel like you're arching off the ground, reduce your amount of rotation. So don't bring your feet all the way to the ground if your lower back begins to arch. And that was 10. Go ahead and place that weight on your stomach. And we're going to do butt raises. Really short movements, just lifting your hips off the ground. If you get too high, that means you are not using your lower abs to pull you up. You are using momentum. So it should be a really, really quick movement using your abs. And that is it. Good job.